Monaco started the year already nine points behind Paris in the league standings, knowing that any further slip-ups could end any chance of them retaining their league title. In their way to the Montpellier side, who boasted the best defence in the championship, conceding just 13 goals in 19 matches. Goals were an issue for the home side, though. Their top scorer, Isaac and Benz, had just four goals, compared to Falcao's 15. Falcao, who was missing for Monaco. But it was Montpellier who started on the front foot. Jonathan Ikone, Zestin Daniel Subasic in goal. A routine save for the Monaco goalkeeper. Monaco quick to respond shortly afterwards. The ball worked to Rashid Ghazal on the right wing. Former Lyon player chanting his luck. It went just wide via deflection. Montpellier had the opportunity afterwards to open the score. It's good work by the midfield. The ball comes out. It's a shot from range and it's a good save. Mendes then had an opportunity for the home side. But once again off target. Difficult chance. And he did well to get something on it. Nil-nil at half time. Monaco really struggling to get it. any decisive attacking move going. Montpellier, on the other hand, doing what they did best. Solid defensively at the back. A defence which was pierced by Ronnie Lopez, who tested Benjamin Lecomte. Good save by the goalkeeper. Jorge was the next man to come forwards, and again it was a phenomenal save by Lecomte. Monaco really hitting their stride in the second half, coming forwards, and Doran with a header. Lecomte saved somehow. Point blank range, good save. Gazal with the free kick right at the end of the match, but it went just wide. Monaco desperately trying to get that vital goal, which would most certainly have given them the win. And a final chance for them, gave nothing. Monaco now 11 points clear if Paris win. Another disappointing result for Leonardo Yardim. Montpellier once again get a clean sheet, their 10th of the season.